We're going to start here by installing Acquia Dev Desktop and setting up a new Drupal 8 site. If you're using a different operating system, particularly Linux, and you don't know how to set up a default Drupal 8 site, please take a look at the short video collection called Setting Up a Web Environment with Drupal. That will walk you through everything that you need. On Windows, this process will be very similar, but again, check out that video collection for specific details on what's different. So I've done a search for Acquia Dev Desktop, and I'm going to go to the Downloads page of Acquia.com. I'm going to grab the version of Acquia Dev Desktop that matches my operating system. For me, it's going to be Mac. As soon as it's downloaded, I'll run it. I'll double click the installer. I'll click Next. Next again. Next one more time. We'll leave these at the defaults and I'll click Next. I've already installed Dev Desktop and it's telling me that I can save a backup of my previous settings. So I'll go ahead and do that and I'll click Next. Next one more time. If you're curious about how Dev Desktop works and all of the technologies involved in a web stack, all of that is explained in the setting up a web environment with Drupal collection. All right, let's click finish and we'll add a new Drupal 8 site. I'll click the plus and then new Drupal site. We're going to pick Drupal 8, so I'll click install here. I'm going to set the code base folder to a folder I've already created. I'll click open. For the local site name, this is for the Magnificent project, so we'll call this Magnificent, and we'll leave everything else at the default, so I'll click Finish. It's asking me if I want to clear out this folder, and it's empty, so I'll click Yes. And then to launch the site, we'll just click this link right here next to Local Site, and here we'll begin the installation process. 